chattels Don't you wanna hear some chattels Okay, chap tale. Um, okay, this this chap tale is just like a little silly, funny story, like a lot of the other ones. <laughs> um, okay, so one, it was when I was in the tally, um, the last um, section of the tally, uh, when when it was me, um, Steve Smith, uh, Richard Fox, and Jack Yetton. And um, I can remember we had, we had a gig at the um, at Camden Rock, which is on. I think it's actually on Kentish Town Road, but it's like right next to Sainsbury's in Camden. There's like this little venue, and it's out of about a million names. But when we played there, it was called Camden Rock, and um, the rehearsals leading up to this gig. Um, I had I had decided that I wanted to play rhythm guitar and I'd been out and I'd got myself a brand new Fender Telecaster Slimline. Cost me about well, we won't talk about how much that cost. Um and also uh I got a new little Marshall 30 watt. It it was it was nothing special, just a solid state small Marshall 30 watt. Um so played the gig and then when when I left the gig obviously I had my guitar in a hard case and I had the amp so my mate was there um Ben Hyde who me and him like it's probably like definitely one of the longest mates I've ever had you know what I mean I was like at nursery with him and stuff like that um but anyway like Ben like he'd had a drink I'd had a drink whatever he sort of said to me, yeah, I'll, I'll, cause we was planning, I, I was planning to take my gear home and then, and then come back down to Camden and, um, carry on with a night out. Do you know what I mean? Like a lot of my mates just like leave their guitars and amps at venues and stuff. And so, yeah, I'll come back tomorrow, but I, I, I can't do all that. You know what I mean? Especially when you got a nice guitar as well. I was just like, right, I'm going to go home put the amp and guitar indoors and then I'll come back down on the bus or whatever but um, as I was leaving the venue with the amp and the guitar Ben sort of said to me oh where you Chapman where you going I was like I'm just going to take this gear home and then I'll be back alright and then he was sort of like oh I'll come with you I'll help you mate and I was like oh alright sweet so um, the guitar's too expensive to let anybody else touch <laughs> so I uh, give him the amp and um so we jumped on the uh, C2 up, up from Camden to Kentish Town and got off the bus, walked over and then where where my mum, where our, my mum lives is up some stairs. Like So we went up the stairs and as we've got halfway up these stairs, quite high stairs as well, the um, handle on the marsh lamp that Ben had in his hand has snapped and the amp has fallen out of his hands, crashed to the stairs, and then rolled down all the stairs. And then when it got to the bottom of the stairs, it like rolled up the road a bit as well. Like, and I was just like, "Oh my god!" I was looking at Ben, and he's like, "Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry." And I was like, "Oh god!" So anyway, we went down and inspected the amp, and do you know what? Like, it it, it was quite smashed, like the plastic cups that are over the corners of the amp were all smashed and the the handle had snapped and and all that and there's a couple of scratches on the wood or whatever but um other than that it, it weren't in such a bad state and ben was like really upset and like and all that and he was like oh, i'll give you the money i'll give you that and i was like no nah, don't be silly mate i was like do you know what i mean <laughs> whatever so um Stuck the amp indoors and that, and then went down Camden, went out on a night out, got out my nut with my pals. And then on the Sunday morning, woke up with an hangover and looked from my bed to the floor next to my bed where the amp was sitting. And I was looking at it thinking, God, you are wrecked. But then um, I had plugged it in and plugged the old guitar into it and, and it it was absolutely fine. So I ordered some 
new Marshall Cups. I don't even know if that's what they're called, but I ordered some of them and, and they came f- from Amazon. New handle and all that. Um, screwed them in, or I actually think, actually, I think you had to hammer them in because they was like, whatever. But yeah, the amp. So once the new handle was on and all the new cups were on and that, and the, the couple of little scratches, you couldn't really see them anyway. But um, yeah, it's all sweet. But but the funny thing is that I, I always wind, wind my mate Ben up with it and, and sort of say to him, like, at the end of any gigs that I'm doing when he's there or whatever, I'm like, you're not carrying nothing. And he's like, oh, boo. No, but, it, but it's all right, it's sweet. Yeah, but um, all right, so that, that was the end of that story. It's just a little story to, uh, yeah. Okay, sweet, um, nice one. Chat tales. Don't you want to hear some chat tales?